Hi, how are you doing? Hope you're all well. This is Tuesday, it's the day, it's the hot when it's about 37, 38 degrees. I've been walking around a really warm house, I'm a bit sweaty, but we're gonna do a property tour um, above all else. This is the most important thing. So uh, let's have a look. We are on St. Austell Close in Horston Grange. Um, lovely little spot here just off Camborne. Um, nice little private kind of area, fairly quiet. It's the no through road. All similar types of houses, three, four bedroom detached properties. And we're here to see, here today to see number 32. Um, and this is a four bed with an extra bedroom. So it's five beds. Had the garage conversion, got a shower room. Obviously you've got that animal next um, area but also could be multiple other uses gym office work things like that um, so let's have a run through I'll show you what's what and then at the end I'll tell you what it's going to the market for so here we are number 32 St Austell Close it's got a driveway get a few cars off on here um, that was our garage you've got your gated access to the side there we've got our front entrance door leading through into our entrance hallway we come in, nice wide hallway, it's a good size. We've got our stairs off and then we've got our door through to our um, downstairs bedroom. And then we've got a door through to the kitchen and through into the lounge and onto diner. Um, so if we go through to what was the garage, it's now a double bedroom, UBC double glazed, it's gas centrally heated throughout, space for a sitting area here. And at the end, we've got this nice uh, full bathroom actually, because you've got your quadrant shower there. And then just behind the door here, we've got a bath. Um, so full bathroom. So lots of potential with this one. Right, let's go to the other side of the hallway and we've got our lounge. It's a good size lounge. Nice box bay window there. Good lighting. And then we've got our double doors going through into our dining room. Table's pushed up against the wall, but it's a good sized room, so you get that in the middle, and that'll probably extend out. So you get eight people around the table there. You've got your double doors out into your garden, and the good old serving hatch, which we don't see very often nowadays, but they're a fabulous idea. So let's go through to the kitchen. So we've got a modern kitchen, got a bit of space for our bits and pieces. We've got a utility room just off there, we've got a fridge freeze, space fridge freeze behind. And into the utility room. So more storage space, there's your backseat boiler on the wall, we've got our side entrance door to the front and the rear. So before we go out the back, let's go upstairs. We've got four more bedrooms. Top of the landing, we have doors to all the bedrooms, we've got a bathroom, we've got a loft access hatch just above us there. Uh, this is bedroom, this is the smaller bedroom, bedroom number four, single room. So good for a kids room. Bedroom number two, another double room. Some wardrobe space around the corner there. They all have storage in these rooms, which is good. Our bathroom, let me just put the light on. Nice modern suite, we've got a shower over the bath as well. We've got your towel radiator just around the corner. So that's all lovely, well presented, well maintained. Our bedroom number one, good size double. You've got the box bay again. So loads of light coming in that takes the room out. That's all storage behind here. So they put a curtain over rather than the doors. I think you would have had kind of sliding doors originally many moons ago, um, but you could always change that over again. And then behind me is the door to the ensuite shower room. Again, modern suite, quadrant shower. Decent fittings, modern power shower. Through the door there, um, there's another room that mirrors the smaller bedroom just there, currently used as an office space, uh, very similar dimensions, obviously with the window going at the front of the house now. And then we've got the cupboard here over the stairs, which is your airing cupboard. Right, see you in the garden. So here we are, just stepping out of the French doors from the dining room into a good sized garden. We've got a lovely large patio here. Leads onto the lawn, we've got fen fencing all surrounding. Nice bit of tree in the corner, just breaks up between the other houses, which is nice. And you can see the addition to the house, that's the utility room added on behind the garage. And all 
not looking very nice on a day like this. Thanks for joining me, particularly on this day for this property tour. Um, sorry if it was a little bit quicker than normal. Obviously it is very, very hot and uh, trying to get round and uh, still be able to speak at the end of it. So I hope you enjoyed it anyway. It's a good sized house. It's a five bedroom detached house. Four bedrooms upstairs, two doubles, two singles, a double downstairs with an ensuite off that as well. Ensuite to the main bedroom upstairs and bathroom. Good sized lounge, dining uh, kind of area um, and kitchen into utility. So all in all, a good quality family home. This property is on the market for 360,000 pounds 360,000 pounds is the asking price and if you'd like to see it just give us a call drop us a line ping us an email and we can arrange that for you in the meantime stay safe out there be careful i'm going to get out of the sun right now and back into the car with the aircon on you should do the same subscribe to our channel so you see these videos as and when they're coming up you'll see properties available before they hit the major property portals bye bye